Hey guys, so I'm starting with this white Hydra Peak cup that I got at TJ Maxx for $9.99. Uh, this brand's really nice. I've used a couple of their cups and they work really, really well. So taking the lid and the sticker off. Then I went ahead and prepped my cup and let it dry. Then we're going to spray paint it this beautiful Hunt Club Green from rust -Oleum. Such a pretty green. So just one coat covered this fine. I know that I told you we're over. I swear that I'm sober. Just listen, I miss you. So finish spray painting that and let it dry. Then we're gonna add our epoxy. This is the Artistry Art and Tumblr Epoxy. Just doing my first layer here. Next, I found these really pretty little stickers at Michael's. These are kind of like iridescent ones. They had different colors, but they're just really pretty little tiny rhinestones on a sticker. So I thought that would be really simple to get like a really pretty little jeweled look on my cup. So I really love how easy and simple it was. You just literally stick it on there. So I just did three little lines at the bottom and then just cut it where it meets the other side. They actually have like full sheets of this stuff also so I think I'm gonna check that out and see how easy that would be to put on a cup but it's the sticker on here is really nice like it's really sticky but not like too sticky where you can't get it off if you put it down in the wrong spot so it was just really nice So then doing some decals, I put Darling You Are Magic on there. I just thought that would be a really cute, a little cute saying. And I did this kind of mint turquoisey color underneath. I just did an offset. I'm not great at doing like the silhouette stuff. If you guys are ever curious what exactly I did, just ask me in the comments and I will try to help you out. But it is kind of confusing and I'm still learning. Okay, and here I am using a transfer paper or a transfer tape and I cannot get any transfer tape to work for me. Like it just literally doesn't stick to my vinyl at all. I was so frustrated because I did so many cups this day. So here's using a second type of transfer tape and it did not work either. So if you guys have a good transfer tape that actually sticks to your vinyl, please leave it in the comments because I'm struggling. But again, got my masking tape. I know everyone's like, why do you keep using masking tape? Like, what is that about? But it's the only thing that works. Those two were also recommendations from other Tumblr makers, so I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong, but I just cannot get it to work for me. I just keep using my masking tape until I find something better. So then I wanted to place that on top of the mint green and off the cup is way easier to do this. I found it easier also to cut the words and do them separately instead of just trying to lay the whole thing at once. Made it a lot easier to kind of place things and make them exactly where I need them.
and then just adding some tape onto the whole thing so that the whole thing is now one piece. So now placing that on my cup. Then I wanted to add a couple little gold stars at the bottom and I had some just stickers laying around so I found three different sizes of gold stars. two with my mixed epoxy the same thing just mix it up and spread it off And when you have anything added to your cup that adds extra like texture or bulk, you want to really make sure to wipe off any excess epoxy in those areas because it can really just grab and hang on and cause like these weird kind of dimples and bumps in your cup. So I was just being very careful and wiping off all the excess around those areas because I just wanted to look really nice and clean. I didn't want bulgy, bumpy epoxy. So then third layer of the epoxy. And then this cup was done. I thought it just turned out really fun, really cute. So that is it for this video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye.